Today is a Friday, please. Yeah. And we have. What time is it? 5.54. At 6 pm. What are we doing at 6 pm? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, so. So we are going to give. We may. We may. Yeah. We may. Yeah. If you stick around, we may give. We give away one of the wallets. Now, not to put on shipi. Yeah. They look like belts. I don't know if they are belts. Are they belts? Yeah, they are belts. <laughs> so, yeah. um, we have some items here. Yeah. Let me let me here. You have the apron, but <laughs> let me have some leather on me. Okay. So. Yeah. Item number one, number two. Yeah. Unayo hapa. Yeah. People are curious. Very true. Very true. <laughs> People are curious. Wana kaya kujua. Kwa nini kuna hizi hizi? Ya hiya wa kisapi. Najua some people might think. Wana juuliza maswali wana wana shindwa. Are we giving you? Are we giving these ones free? Yeah. Are you giving them free? No, we are giving just free knowledge. I like what you say, free knowledge. Yeah. It's about, about how to maintain the dust and the sleeves, the wallets and the straps. Hi. So we have beds. Yeah. This is my favorite bed, by the way. This is the reverse. So this is the reverse patina. Yeah. Um, today we are going to talk about leather maintenance. Just a short video. Um, this leather we need to talk about. We have to discuss this. We have to discuss this. <laughs> yes. So this is a belt. Good to con leather is like your skin, so it's good to condition it for everyone in a wire. The same way your skin needs oil, the same way your skin needs um, moisturizers, conditioners. Leather is the same way. So, we are going to do a short video how to quickly just condition the leather to keep it supple. Because you always want your leather to feel nice and supple and soft. So, frequent conditioning is necessary. What do we use for conditioning? We have the astonisher. So, we have this is astonished leather conditioning here. Yeah. Um, in the belt packaging, they usually come with a small brochure that details how to maintain your belt and this is one of the leather conditioners that we recommend um, it's not the best worldwide it's the best locally um, but we want to try something with some some, some brand called Safir. anyway this is the one that we recommend so what this does in a equal leather conditioner cream Cleans, nourishes, restores, protects leather. Yeah. I like that. I like those words. <laughs> so you have to take care of your leather items. Yeah. Let's do this quickly. What you usually do. I think you should do this. I'm not fine. Then you can do the sleeve yeah. or the wallets. Um, now this is a piece of cloth. 
preferably cotton. You want something that is very soft and very gentle on the leather, yeah. and it needs to be able to rub it in very well. So it, it has to kind of absorb. Yeah. So if you are to use, imagine using something like polythene. Yeah, yeah. Polythene, do it. you are not doing anything of much value. So first of all, you take one to have this belt is only come two to have this second one is a free to have it's not for use when you're wearing the belt simply for storage and we don't show you how such as the way this one is rolled and the second keeper is the one that is keeping the belt rolled and running so it's very nice for storage and it's very nice so it's a stony screen can do it two ways. Some people like to just um, pour it directly on the leather. Some people prefer to do it on the floor. I like to do it on the floor. So that by the time you see when I'm applying, I do a new color application. If I just pour it on the leather, it would. Um, so I think we should take a before and after of this. Yeah. Before and after video. Anyway, guys, now let's get to the close-up. Uh, the first thing is to see how it looks the before. Yeah. Um, I don't know if it's the black one may not change much. We have a dark brown one that um in may cook for storage for some time. Yeah. Um some we usually have ready-made belts in certain sizes. So if it's there for some time we still condition it after a while to keep it still fresh and supple ready for the time when it will find a new foster home <laughs> i'm a caretaker yeah. i read this thing about patek philip it was like a, a poster yeah. that you don't what was it you don't um own a, a Patek Philippe or use it. You don't use it. Yeah. You take care of it for the next generation because it's a, it's a watch that is built to last decades. Um, so the dark brown deal. This is a prototype. Um, or this is the one we should. You know, this is a new belt. Yeah. This is a new model. Yeah. Um, First edition. Yeah. Mahana Range Rover first edition. <laughs> this is first edition of um we have to name this belt by the way. Yeah. Flat belt. I think we should should find a, a better way of describing describing flat. Words are very important. So anyway. Very true. I'm thinking plain. <laughs> plain belt. Anyway. Yeah. This is our new belt. Ladies and gentlemen, yeah, of the leather community, yeah. Um, the difference between these two is padded is, as you can see, the center part is raised. But with this other one, it's the whole belt is flat. Can can that be yeah, seen? Yeah, that can be seen. Okay. Yeah. So the, with this one, if you look even at um, these inner sides, the inner sides are a bit dry. Yeah. You end up on the engine. Um, also a bit dry because yeah. in a car, yeah. in a car kiasi. Yeah. yeah. So, in a kumbuka, what you normally do first is you start with removing any dust, yeah. any particles that might be on the belt. Yeah, bath in with a blush. So you do that first. Yeah. You remove any kind of particles. Yeah. So that now the conditioner is contacting the leather directly. Yeah. But mostly done with a soft blush. Yes, actually we recommend this. I've had this brush for I almost said five I think it's five years back. Yeah. You know I bought this brush when I was, was I in high school. <laughs> My mom bought me a piece of three um the rules are brush off the dirt yeah. with a horse hair shoe brush, yeah. followed by now you, you start doing the conditioner. You can apply it directly, but I prefer doing it here so that it's an even application yeah. on the belt itself. Yeah. Um, then 
you can see I'm doing it in circles. I think this is so natural that <laughs> you may realize yeah. so late into the video yeah. that this is another thing. You don't do it in lines. You're doing it in circles so that um, you are forcing the conditioner in yeah. from all angles. Yeah. So that now the pores can soak them yeah. in properly. Okay. Um, I think we are done. Eh? Yeah, we are done. We are done. Yeah. I think we have enjoyed making this video. Yeah. Um, I hope it helps some of you because I've received questions how to not not from my clients. My clients to my sorts. The brochure yeah. is the one time fix. They know how to do it, but some of them um prefer to have us do it yeah so we've enjoyed making this video for anyone who would like to diy of course it's always cheaper and with videos like this you can do it the right way yeah so come my video mekubamba in english if this video has been of um has been enlightening to you we shot it on a friday evening so um if you can <laughs> just leave a like button yeah on, on, hit the like button yeah. share it with people people who like good leather items people who like to maintain yeah uh their things well this belt is worth eight thousand one hundred and fifty so you don't want to buy it a lafu you just neglect it very true leather like we said is just like your skin which needs um, oils, conditioners, because it loses its oils in yeah. use. Yeah. But then with the conditioner, the whole the conditioner does is to restore those oils yeah. so that it stays supple, yeah. it stays young, yeah. and it prevents that dryness, which yeah, true. for so many years, I mean, it won't crack. Yeah. But at some point, if you haven't conditioned it for like 10 years, yeah. and it's always there, Very then... True. I mean, you're, neglect, you're neglecting it unless you have 8,000 to burn. Yeah. But if you're going to give you that wallet, then we hope you will take care of it. Yeah. Um, in September, you're going to offer the belt as a whole package. Um, someone asked me, how, how the hell do you expect to sell? <laughs> how the hell do you expect to sell a belt for 10,000? We are selling... Um, much more than that it's the whole package yeah. or the whole experience of owning luxury leather items Very true. they need proper maintenance yeah you can't own a rolex and then you don't take it for servicing yeah um, and uh, servicing a rolex is expensive of course Very true. but with this we make it easier by you can do it yourself you're yeah. going to include a small cloth yeah um, we're going to have the belt in there the brochure with how to maintain the belt and then the supplies that you need to maintain the belt. Yeah. Which is basically the conditioner yeah. and the cloth, either a cloth or a soft brush. Yeah. Um, we'll see before September. So when that when, when we've already done that, then the whole package is going to the basic belt is going to start at ten thousand. Yeah. Um those conditioners will last you a very long time. Yeah. So they save you the cost of having to bring the belt back for us to maintain yeah and we recommend very good quality conditioners that we use we also recommend good quality ones very true but we also use very good quality conditioners yeah um more, quite a number of them are imported and i actually know of one of anyway that's a story for another day <laughs> that's a story for another day yeah um so guys those are two belts this one is eight thousand one hundred and fifty. yeah this new belt we're still to because we start we want to offer some extra options yeah and let that rest buckle yeah um that would cost around 500 but the starting of this new belt which yeah. is now the flat belt yeah it's going to start at around between 6500 yeah um we might start doing it in a different type of leather yeah there is what we call camel leather um, so now depending on the leather, yeah, because um, camel leather will have a different base price yeah. than cow leather. Yeah, um, I've always wanted to try out camel leather, yeah. so we are going to before before September. Then we are going to do the camel leather one, and then release the official pricing. Should we give this 
away. Yes, you can give out. <laughs> no, you're very generous, my friend. I'm very generous. For you're very generous. <laughs> um, but they, for Father's Day, we only have two left. Yeah. One of them we may give away. This is, just look at that contrast. This is navy blue and orange. orange. Um, the money clip, like we said, that's how it's done. This is, the thickness here is just 6 millimeters. That is 0 0.6 centimeters on this. So we have the wallet. Yeah. The wallet is worth 7,000. We said 6,550. 6, yeah. But if you add the customization, because yeah. we are going to do the customization for free, then it will be plus 350. Yeah. Which is meaning this is a giveaway. Yeah. Worth 7,300. Very true. That's for the wallet. Yeah. Um, the belt, I think we are going to do it later. Once we have the camel, yeah. Once we have the camel, so we have the camel and this one, then we can do that one later. Yeah. But for now, you stand a chance to win this. The money clip. The money clip wallet. Yeah. So the code, we have talked about the code. We have talked about the code. This is the code, guys. This is the code. This is the code. This is the code. So, astonish. Yeah. Type in this code, don't even do the premium leather, just this code. Um, type in, once you see it, then type it in our Instagram. It's not going to be like um, the first one wins. It's, yeah. We are going to do it randomly um, and announce the winner on June 30th. 30th. Yeah. My birthday is on July 7th. Okay. So, yeah. if you also want to gift me, <laughs> um, that would be a very good time to do it. <laughs> And I would be very grateful. Very true. Um, gifting is good. Very true. Anyway, I, to, the, to the person who wins this, I hope you take care of it. It's going to come with um, the full package. It's packaged in a box yeah. and um, an A4. We have a video that shows our packaging that we're going to link here on this video so that you can see how the packaging looks like. Um, that's the um, so you also. Um, so if you like this video, the like button is right below the video. Yeah. We'd really appreciate it. Um, if you think someone, if you, if you know someone who would find value in this video, then um, recommend it to them. Very true. Um, subscribe. We have more of these videos coming up. Yeah. Um, like we said, we are going to follow it up. My mom bought me shoes. Um, right now I'm 23 years old. My yeah. mom bought me a pair of shoes when I was 19. Yeah. Uh, because they, I finished high school 18. Okay. So the next year was the price giving. Yeah. I still have those shoes. Yeah. Um, day in the in So oh. we are going to do two videos. One yeah. is, yeah, cozy revamp with some dyes. Yeah. To give them a fresh look. Yeah. And then the second one now is polishing, yeah. which also includes maintenance. It's, it's maintenance that includes conditioning, polishing, and stuff. Yeah. So subscribe if you want to see those videos. And even you can share. Yes, and share. Yeah. This is Creative Nation. <laughs> Thank you for your time. I don't and weekend. Uh, interesting evening. Yeah. Everybody have a nice weekend. Very true. Chris. <laughs> Kazi, Kazi, Mande, Kazi, you find you. Kabisa. Shukua Kazi, sis. Because, yeah. Ah, yeah. Um, let's let's finish up the video and go back. Yeah.